Hi everyone, I'm Matt and I'm a physicist. I spent most of my professional physics life doing uh, research into hot fusion, which is what goes on in the center of stars. Today though, I do cold fusion research, which is completely different. There's a story behind the shift from hot to cold, as you might imagine, uh, just like there's a story behind cold fusion itself, where it came from, why it's important, why you should care about it, but they are longer stories, which we will save for another day. This video is about something uh, very practical. You see, I've been building up to my first cold fusion experiment for quite some time, and it's happening tomorrow, which I'm stupidly excited about. Um, I put a link in the description below where you can find out more information and follow me if you are interested. The practical thing we're going to be talking about is how I prepare my materials to go into my cold fusion reactor. I've been inspired by a Japanese researcher called Mizuno, so I'm following along as close as I can to his procedure. So without further ado, I will let you watch the procedure and hopefully it is instructive, insightful, and that you enjoy it. Please bear in mind there is one safety concern about the production of fine nickel powder. Don't do this unless you've read all the information in the description below. Please do wear breathing protection and do this in a well ventilated space. Thank you. 